Psychology fact about human behavior. Your brain is less attentive during intercourse, as the trigger for fear and anxiety is switched off during female orgasm. Women are more likely to cheat on their partners when they are ovulating. Women reach the peak of pleasure with masturbation instead of penetration because just like good masturbation, you can stimulate the clitoris. People have all kinds of nicknames for the clitoris. The canoe man, the rosebed, the bell of joy, and even chickpeas and lentils. Some women like to be touched gently, while others prefer more sexualization. No wonder some women have stronger orgasms in their midlife and after menopause. The clitoris can be 2.5 times larger than when the same woman was a teenager. Being tied up increases a person's ability to reach orgasm. Being well hydrated leads to better orgasms as the body is mostly liquid. Every woman is unique in that her nerve endings are distributed in her genitals differently, like a snowflake. Women have two erogenous zones, the G-spot and the opening of the cervix. If you want to address the clitoris, labia, and vagina together, vulva is the umbrella term. The clitoris contains 9,000 sensitive nerve endings, twice the number in the penis. A clitoral orgasm can cause 5 to 15 contractions and can last 10 to 30 seconds. If your wife always remembers things from the past in maximum detail, don't worry. It's normal. Women have a better memory capacity. The part of the brain activated during orgasm is also activated when women have food cravings. A study from Indiana University found that using condoms does not affect orgasm production. Condoms stored in wallets for more than a month are more likely to break. One study found that good sex activates the brain region associated with passion. In England, 90% of adults admitted to having some form of sexual interaction in the office. Ginger stimulates feelings of excitement, increases your heart rate, and gets your blood flowing, preparing you for the night ahead. We automatically pursue people who smell good and are more attractive. There are no excuses for not using condoms and being vulnerable to STDs. It's no use for the man to try his best if the woman is thinking about what to do tomorrow instead of focusing on the present. Orgasm in women begins in the brain. Frequent sex and orgasms are not prescribed by doctors, but they directly strengthen the immune system. Studies have found that masturbation in women can reduce the risk of type 2 diabetes. Women are slower to climax than men and need at least 15 minutes of correct stimulation. An Italian study found that women who ate apples experienced increased lubrication and sexual function, boosting their libido. Nearly 75% of respondents would like to have sex at least three times a week. A recent fertility survey in Denmark found that 55% of women are not having as much sex as they would like. The vagina averages three to four centimeters in length, but can expand by 200% when sexually aroused. Some foods, like raspberries, increase sexual desire. Female ejaculation, also known as squirting, is not an urban legend. Many women claim to have experienced this while masturbating, not with a man. During orgasm, a woman releases the famous and precious hormone endorphin, known as the happiness hormone, which helps relieve physical and emotional pain. 85% of couples in the United States don't have sexual conversations about what the other person likes, leading to boredom in sex. Many women think they are anorgasmic, but there are reasons such as continuous medication, hormonal dysfunction, or lack of ability on the part of men. The smell of pumpkin can stimulate blood flow, helping with erection. Like the ear and nose, the clitoris never stops growing, and in your 30s, it is four times bigger than it was as a teenager. Greece is the most sexual place in the world. There is no relationship between the size of the foot and the size of the penis. This is a myth. 40% of men and 35% of women only have sex once a week because they work too many hours. The more work you have, the more stress you have, and the more stress you have, the less sex. For most women, sex starts before sex. So don't just focus on getting her on all fours. Think about how to stimulate her before that. According to statistics, 80% of women are anorgasmic, meaning they have never experienced an orgasm in their lives. Did you know that 97% of women in the world choose a man as a partner depending on how good he is in bed? Certain aspects of female psychology are still not fully understood. 
Women are a mystery to men. Having sex after going to the gym is a good idea as exercise increases blood flow to the genital area and boosts testosterone levels. Seven out of ten women date men they meet online and all admit to regretting it. 30% of people under 40 check their social media right after having sex, and 20% of people under 35 use their cell phones during sex. Men under 40 take about 10 seconds to get an erection. These three sex positions are most likely to make you orgasm. 1. Cowgirl This move puts you in control. You can manage the pace and depth of penetration, mixing between shallow and deep thrusts to stimulate the front third of your vagina, the most sensitive part. 2. Doggy style Penetration from behind allows the tip of his penis to touch your cervix, which is covered in nerve endings. Have him thrust slowly and gently. 3. Missionary It's intimate. You can look each other in the eyes and maximize skin-to-skin -skin contact, enjoying the friction of his pelvis on your clitoris. Which of these facts resonate with you? Share in the comments below. Please like this video and subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. See.